Good day guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. In my last video tutorial, I talk about how to insert radio button in Nuse. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use fill handle in Nuse. Okay, fill handle in Nuse is used to fill up the data by creating a series of num or series of values that either follows a pattern or check if this value we enter uh, or series it is very easy to implement field handle is available at the bottom right of any cell just enter some value such as numbers or alphabet or date in at least three cell okay to have a pattern select the cell with values and then either drag the fill handle or double click we, uh, we also work here okay in the active cell of the worksheet the fill handle is a small black box at the bottom right corner okay a basic level of knowledge about fill handle in a cell could save you ton of your productive time at your workplace it is a tool which can be used to auto complete a series of lists in a cell generally in a cell we enter serial number let's say um, serial number from 1 to 10 okay just like that okay just like one two three four and so on okay from cell a one to world a ten okay we usually type one two three like that isn't it okay instead of manual typing we can use an excel fill and to auto fill the series of what numbers or date or days it is now let's dive into how to enable fill and do if you cannot find the fill and do in z okay if you do not find a, a fill and do in z you need to do some settings here we can enable the fill and do option although it is enabled by default it may happen that you disable it by mistake now let, let me show you how to enable it okay now go to the first thing is that just go to the file option right here okay you can see now go to the option menu just click on it so you want to do that select the advanced option right here so now what after that make sure that the fee Lando option you can see enable fill and do and say drag and drop is this option is checked so if it is not checked just make sure that it is checked and after that you click on what okay button now now let's dive into how to use fill and do in the z fill and do in the z is very simple and easy to use let us understand the working of is there fill and do by some example based on what I have on my screen here? Assuming you want to fill the numbers from 1 to what 15, okay, right here. Now, here are the steps to auto fill the to auto fill your series of numbers here. Okay, now the first thing is that so just enter one, okay, one and one and two. In the cell here that from cell a1 and cell a2 and select those two say just select it so once you do that now over the mouse okay just over the mouse over the bottom right edge okay okay bottom right edge of the selection you will see a plus sign icon and drag until you find cell a15 you can see okay in the above key you need to drag to 
until you find a, your desired cell okay however if there is a value in the adjacent column right here you can over you can just hover the mouse over the right okay over the right edge of the selection and just double click okay just double click okay so once you do that once you do that it will automatically fill up the list to the last cell based on the data in the adjacent column now let's look at the second table here we have serial number okay and the month okay as my table head now let's fill the cell f2 you can see it's a f2 to f13 with month okay okay so i can i will type january okay february so let me now let can let me now auto fill the remaining ones okay you can see so just like what we did right here okay now i need to insert the serial number from cell e2 to what e13 okay from say e2 to insert serial number from say e2 to say e13 i just need to type one okay and two and i will and just and i will select the the two say and double click okay you can see double click it will fill up the say on the the say e 13 is uh, accomplished okay also we can also auto fill numbers okay that decrement by one just like what i have done in the previous example here we can auto fill numbers by incremented by one similarly we can insert numbers decremented by one okay now to in order to do that so what you need to do is just let's say i want to fill a number that is decremented by one so what i need to do is i just type I can type the uh, the uh, and I can type ten here. Then I can then type nine. Then I can then fill up the cell here. You can see, you can see ten nine eight seven six. Okay. Now since we do not have the adjacent column, we cannot double click. Okay. Double click on the fill and insert. You just need to what the drag on the cell J19 is fill up. So now it will insert the number for you. So, however, we can also use fill and in Excel to auto complete weekdays, weekdays names, auto auto fill date, auto fill week dates, and many more. Okay, thank you, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel as I. Keep giving you more of the Excel function. Bye and stay blessed.